Lambert, I don't know what your job is, but uh, keep it up. Poor Lambert's just enjoying the show. So do you come here often? No. <laughs> I caught my wife out here. She's just sitting, just sitting out here in the goat yard for no good reason, just, just chilling. <laughs> Actually, we've got a really good reason. <laughs> we're on maternity watch. My wife brought her camera. She wants to get some good pictures. And we're gonna try, we've got one big doe left a kid. And she's the probably the reason why I don't have board goats anymore. All the rest of the Kiko does kitted all within a week of each other. I've got one boar doe left, and she's, what, a month and a half late? I, I don't know what her deal is, but today's the day I can feel it. Actually, I, I can't feel it. <laughs> I can see it. I, I came out and fed the goats, took care of the goats, and she keeps drifting off by herself. Every time they act like it's, we're gonna, they're going to eat some more, she'll run up here, and then she drifts off by herself, and she's got some, some really nasty-looking mucus. So, we're gonna try to catch this one last goat birth of the year on video, except maybe Skip. Skip may have kids, but I'm not sure. I don't think she's pregnant. She could be, but this one for sure is gonna have babies, and it's going to happen today. Are you excited? I am. That's why I come down here. It's oh. for the babies. Do what? So that's why I come down here. It's for the babies. And to sit with me. We're just, we're literally just uh, sitting out here. Just. Chilling on the ground in the goat poop. I'm trying not to be in the goat. Thanks for the view, Lambert. So if you're kind of around your goats enough and observant, you can tell when they're gonna kid. So these does, you know, I kid my does out on pasture. They, they can kid wherever they want. I don't use stalls. But when a doe's getting ready to kid, she'll she'll get pretty vocal and just act different, she kind of acts funny, but they'll go off by herself, like she's done right now. She was here eating, and she's gone off, laid down by herself. It's gonna happen soon. Hey Lambert, are you excited? You're gonna be an ant soon. Did you know that? You're gonna be an ant. <laughs> it's okay. Mom will be all right. She's just having more babies. What do you think, Bear? Everybody's excited. New, new life on the farm today, huh? What do you think, Bear? Huh? You ready to see it? <coughs> Good job. Looky there. What is it, Bear? What is it? Well, we got one so far. Thanks, Bear. You like to get right in the middle of my shot, don't you? One kid so far, as big as she is, she should have multiple. Hopefully, hopefully at least twins or triplets. That would be nice. Look at her. Oh, they get that big yawn right after they have a baby. I haven't checked to see if it's a boy or a girl yet. We will pretty soon. But I'm excited to see if she has another one. <laughs> Are you pushing again, Mama? 
<laughs> Looks like we got another one coming. Definitely, it's still in the sack. <laughs> now that's pretty cool. That baby's still in the sack. Two babies. First one's trying to get up and walk around. The second one just just came out. Did you see that? It was it was still in the sack. My wife informed me. Hang on a second. I said, "Oh, she's gonna have it still in the sack." And she said, "That's not what it's called. What's it called?" In call. In call. No, what's it called? E N space C A U L. Oh, whatever. Okay, <laughs> technical, technical. It was still cool to watch. Would you not agree? So you guys may not be able to notice. You you may not be able to see what's going on here. And I don't know if Barrel will show us, but he's doing a really cool thing. So you know, Bear and Bell are buddies. They play together every single day. Well, Bella wanted to come out and investigate what's going on. And just notice, just watch Bear back here, okay? He hasn't been mean to Bella at all. He didn't growl, he didn't do a thing. But every time Bella tries to get close, he will like run in between her and the mama goat. He like, he knows his job and he's doing a good job of it. Even with Bella, who is a friend out here. Good job, buddy. Are you being protective? You doing your job? You're good at it too, you know that? Lambert, I don't know what your job is, but uh, keep it up. <laughs> Poor Lambert's just enjoying the show. Oh, good mama push it out that baby's still completely in call right that's right oh there it goes <laughs> Help you get him out of the back. There you go, little one. Let's hear it. Come on, mama. Good towel. Hey, mama. Focus on this one. Roll it out, baby. There you go. That's three. Check it out. Bear, I don't need you right in the middle, buddy. Lay down. Lay down. Oh my gosh, bear. Bear, now I got Bella. So you guys know when my doe's kid, really, really, everybody's all antsy and nervous. You guys know I'm really big on when I kid, I try not to assist my does. I don't want to help them at all. Well, that baby was born still in call, I would say, still in the birth sack. And it was just laying there on the ground. I couldn't help but just, just clean his face off and let him get a breath of air. Mom's doing her job. She's taking care of two others and still pushing. So it doesn't hurt anything. I, that baby probably would have been just fine without my assistance. I didn't save its life or anything like that. Fair. You're ridiculous, buddy. You're ridiculous. I can't do anything with you dogs. So it looks like she's gonna quit at three. Bear, I don't need you in this shot. Stop. Lay down, Bear. Lay down. 
Lay down. So it looks like she's going to stop at three. One's up trying to nurse right now. It looks like he's trying to suck on the wrong end. So the first two that were born were boys. The big brown one that's nursing. And the one that looks like an Oreo. Bear. No. No. I'm not being mean to you, Bear. No. I'm not being mean. No. Lay down. Lay down. The one that looks like an Oreo, the second one born, is also a boy. And then the little bitty one, the last one born, is a girl. So two boys and a girl. And they're all doing good. I don't think she's going to have another one. She's out of active labor. She's got three little fluid sacs. She's still got to pass. But she's up doing her job. And uh, no assistance necessary, really. I cleaned one's mouth off, and that's about it. Bear is, uh, apparently he needs attention too. He's, he's having a little anxiety this morning, I think, but everybody's good. That was the last doe. She's been holding out on us. And that's why, like I said earlier, that's why I love my Kikos. They're dependable. They're rock solid. They know what they're doing. They're great mothers. She's been a good mom, but why in the world is it just coincidence? The one boar doe that I have left, I keep her around because she's pretty. She's the most friendly. She's got a great personality. I just have a hard time getting rid of her and she throws good looking kids. So she's, she stays, but she's the one boar doe I have left and she kids a month and a half later than all of my on schedule Kiko does. Kind of weird. Well, that's pretty funny right there. That second born, uh, the black and white one, looks like an Oreo. Hasn't even stood up yet, but he's big enough that he could reach up and start nursing. So he's nursing before he ever learned to walk. <laughs> that's pretty crazy. <laughs> That's it. Mama had three kids, one doe and two little bucks, and they're all up and doing awesome. The spotted boar goats are, are they're really pretty. I, I, I thought about getting more spotted boar goats at one point in time, but I really like the Kikos. But one thing about the spotted boars is they sell very, very well. That, that one doe right there, I could probably sell her for five, $600 pretty easy. So her kids are gonna be pretty valuable. They're gonna be 50%, well, she's not 100% boar, but she's pretty close to it. So she's boar, and the buck is my Kiko, old jerk face. He's a proud daddy again today. So they're gonna be 50% Kiko, 50% boar, give or take. They're not, they're neither one of them are registered, but they're really good. They're gonna be really good kids. I hope they all three survive. They're up, all three have nursed, they're all walking, and uh, we're gonna let her do her job for a couple hours before I come back and ear tag them so guys that's all i've got for today thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it and uh as always we'll see you on the next video